Used car prices are still high, and it's getting tougher to find affordable power, but deals are out there if you know where to look. So get your checkbooks ready and start digging in the change drawer for this year's list of cars with 300 horsepower for under $10,000. For the latest automotive lists, news, reviews, and more, check out MotorOne.com. And be sure to subscribe to MotorOne on YouTube, TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Before we get into the fun stuff, a few rules. We're aiming to hit a $10,000 price point, give or take a few hundred bucks, based on good condition. And because people now keep their cars for nearly 12 years, we increase the age range to match putting our search somewhere in the neighborhood of 2012 vehicles. First, we have the 2011 Camaro V6 at $9,272. You used to be able to buy a used Chevy Camaro with a V8 for under $10,000, but times have changed. Instead, we're left with just the V6 option in the 2011 Camaro LS. At least you'll have bragging rights over Mustang owners because your 3.6 liter V6 makes 312 horsepower to the Stang's 305. Plus, these older Camaro models have the best version of the car's design from the days before Chevy designers began fussing with it. Next up is the dearly departed Saab 9.5 Aero at $8,936. This model year was near the end of the line for Saab, and the fact that the 9.5 at the time was an all new design makes this car even more of a unicorn. If you can find the top of the line Aero model though, you'll get a great looking Swedish sedan with a unique turbocharged 2.8 liter V6 producing 300 horsepower. It even comes with all wheel drive, making the 2011 95 a nice option for cold climates. Since Saab no longer exists, you may have trouble finding parts or service, but that's a small price to pay for driving something truly unique. Here we have the 2012 BMW 550i at $7,932. The F10 BMW 5 Series dropped its predecessor's 4.8 liter V8 for a smaller but turbocharged 4.4 liter engine, upping its output from 360 horsepower to a hearty 400 and improving its zero to 60 time by half a second. The F10 generation also marked the arrival of a new eight speed automatic transmission, electric power steering, and all wheel drive. This estimate is for one in good condition with 85,000 miles on the odometer, but if you're willing to risk a car with over 100,000 miles, you might find it for even cheaper. If you want a large rear wheel drive sedan, try the 2012 Chrysler 300C at $9,105. It comes with a brand's venerable 5.7 liter V8, producing 363 horsepower. This model year was right after the 300's major redesign and came with upgrades like a super large 8.4 inch infotainment screen with the brand's much loved Uconnect operating system. Despite this car being a decade old, its tech package at the time was advanced and has kept the car feeling modern. Coming at $9,934 is the 2012 Dodge Charger RT. Dodge updated the Charger in 2011, marking the nameplate's seventh generation. It ushered in newer and more powerful variants like the RT, which upped the car's output to 370 horsepower from the 5.7 liter Hemi V8. While still not nearly as affordable as its predecessor, you should be able to snag a seventh gen charger for under $10,000 if you know where to look. The Ford Taurus might not be synonymous with performance, but the 2012 Ford Taurus show with performance package certainly delivers at only $9,109. The 2010 Ford Taurus show was the rebirth of the Mark's famous super high output model from the late 80s and 90s. And you could get a 2012 model for well under our price cap. Featuring a twin turbocharged 3.5 5 liter EcoBoost V6, it produced 365 horsepower. And a word of advice, if you can find one with a performance package, get it. This option included better brakes, steering tweaks, a sport mode with stability control, summer tires, and omitted a spare tire to save some weight. Here at the halfway point of our list is the 2012 Hyundai Genesis 5.0 at $9,731. The Hyundai Genesis launched in the 2009 model year and by 2012 was being offered with a giant five liter V8 engine producing 429 horsepower. That's 29 more horsepower than the original Dodge Viper which you assuredly can't buy for under 10 large. Hyundai also offered an R-Spec version of this model that added some go-fast hardware, but unfortunately it doesn't quite fall under our price target. So you'll have to make do with this fine handling, luxurious, high-tech and powerful luxury sedan. You'll be okay, we promise. At $10,071, we have the 2012 Infiniti G37S Coupe. Sure, you should be able to find a base coupe for well under $10,000, 
But if you want the sportier S model and are willing to risk it on a car with 100,000 miles, you'll get a 330 horsepower version with bigger brakes, bigger wheels, a six speed manual, and a sportier suspension setup. The 3.7 liter V6 gives it a zero to 60 time of 5.5 seconds. Granted, the G37 doesn't exactly meet the criteria of under $10,000, but what's $71 between friends? The most powerful car on our list, the 2012 Jaguar XF Supercharged comes in at a reasonable $8,623. Its breathing assisted 5 liter V8 engine produces a staggering 470 horsepower. Sure, these weren't the most reliable machines when new, but if you look for one with a full history of recorded maintenance, you should be fine. The 2012 Jaguar XF Supercharged has made this list every year we've done it, in fact, and may never be topped as the king of cheap horsepower. The 2013 BMW 335i Coupe costs $9,290 today. The 335i was a reasonably fun luxury performance car that packed a 300 horsepower, 3 liter inline 6 engine, a 6 speed manual, and rear wheel drive. Find one with just over 85,000 miles, and we estimate that you should be able to take it home for under 10 grand. The second Hyundai on our list, the 2013 Hyundai Genesis Coupe 3.8, comes in at $9,369. Not only did the Genesis Coupe get a new look for 2013 that included an updated interior, but Hyundai added more oomph to the 3.8 liter model, giving it 333 horsepower. With that punchier V6 and rear wheel drive, the Genesis Coupe scoots to 60 in just 5.5 seconds. And in our humble opinion, it doesn't look half bad while doing it. At $9,034, here's the 2014 Cadillac CTS Coupe. Even though Cadillac updated the CTS sedan for the 2014 model year, the Coupe soldiered on into the new year with minimal changes, with 318 horsepower and a six-speed automatic transmission and rear-wheel drive. And you should be able to find a well-kept example for under $10,000. Rounding out our list is the 2015 Ford Mustang V6 at $10,938. We know, we know, we're stretching the definition of under $10,000 thousand dollars uh in fact we're ignoring it with prices destined to drop further by the time you watch this video we still think it's a good pick at that price you get a 3.7 liter v6 engine good for 300 horsepower paired to either a six-speed manual transmission or an optional six-speed automatic we can't recommend the manual highly enough and the car will still get you to 60 miles per hour in 5.5 seconds and there you have it. Some of the best 300 plus horsepower cars you can get for under 10 grand. Which of these cars would you like to see in your garage? Did we miss any? Let us know in the comments below. And for a more luxurious change of pace, check out our list of the 50 most expensive cars in the world. 